Hello, so I will be talking about Johnny Depp today. His acting technique that he uses is from Michael Chekhov, and Michael Chekhov's technique actually came from another method known as the Stan Islovsky. It's really hard to say, but that method, and basically that method, um, is a method where you recall from your own emotions as a human you pull from your own situations in life and Chekhov actually had a nervous breakdown and he didn't want to practice that so he made the Chekhov method and that's where he practiced a physical and imagination based system of achieving character through physicalizing a character's need through an external gesture. Then that gesture is unlearned through rehearsal and performed internally. So Johnny Depp, he actually didn't graduate high school and he didn't go to college. And the way he got into acting was actually through his wife, ex-wife now, but at the time it was his wife and he was a struggling musician at the time and his ex-wife introduced him to Nicolas Cage and that was his her ex-boyfriend at the time but Nicolas Cage saw some acting potential within Johnny Depp and then he introduced him to directors and that's where he got a start and then in the 1980s he actually started having acting lessons and he studied um, at LA's Loft Studio, and then he also had private coaches as well. And some of the lessons Johnny Depp actually shared with some Chinese students at the time included the importance of observation. So Johnny Depp said that one of his favorite pastimes was people watching, and that's an element of acting, and it's an important element of acting that he liked. And he actually shared with students that body language and speaking styles are two things picked up from observing people. So what does he value in his craft? Um, a quote by him, he actually said, the most important thing that an actor needs to do is to not act, but to react. That's what it's all about. And you do one of the most difficult things in the world, which is just to be, to be in that state of being. So. He values not, he values the being genuine and pulling from a character and just being that character. Um, and he also values reacting. So in his mind, he is that character. And how would that character react to certain stimula simulations and like just completely completely embodying that character so what does he value about fellow actors on set um this one is a little bit more hard to research but after researching some of the fellow actors that he worked with on set um, i would say that he genuinely values getting along with the other person on set and make sure that they feel comfortable and basically what he wants is what he gives. So if he is being respectful and nice and helping that person out on set, he wants the same respect back. So some people that he's worked with is Angelina Jolie. He talks about, she talks about Johnny Depp and she says, he's just a nice guy. He's so funny and so fun to hang out with. He's just the friend you're happy to come work with. Kira Knightley says, he's just great. It's just really weird because he's a huge star in Hollywood, but he's such a nice bloke. Winona Ryder says, I truly and honestly only know him as a really good man, an incredible, loving, extremely caring guy who was so very protective of me and the people that he loves. And I felt so very, very safe with him. Juliet Lewis says, in other words, he's a very humble and always tries to make others around him know he doesn't think he's better than anyone else. Some actors lack this type of sensitivity, but she explains that he doesn't. So based off those quotes from some of the actresses that he's worked with, that genuinely makes me believe that 
he wants the same kind of respect back and he wants just a happy environment so my views hasn't changed on him if anything i have more respect for him after seeing the struggles that he's gone through and he's you know he dropped out of high school he never went to college and he's always grown as an actor and as a person throughout these years and he's insanely talented and not many people has that drive and can handle what he's been through so i look up to him as a person and an actor